Okay, and what are you like, what are you wanting to look at, Heidi? Um, so one thing, it's telling me I have branching logic errors in my survey that I want to send out, and I just can't even remember how to take my own survey. Okay. It's been probably two months since I was in REDCap, and of course I forgot everything. Yeah, why don't you open our record, Tanya, and see where the branching logic stops you, just so you can look at that field. Is it on which, there we go, what instrument is it on? It's on the three month survey. Okay, there you go. So it might be easier like um, number 20, record there number 20. There you go, so you can see which field is the problem. And we're going for group three. Yeah, that's what it keeps doing to me. I'm going to um, move your project into development as we work through this. Is that sure. all right? Or do you want me to keep it? Oh, no, that's fine. Going back to project development, Heidi, is something that we can do, but you can't do. But it just makes it easier for us to work on your project and make changes or troubleshoot if we just move it back. And when we're done, we can move it back into production for you. That's fine. And I think um, I ran into something else when I was trying to schedule something, the survey that I was like, I'm going to need help with that. So. Okay, so let's go back out here again and start this. And it gives us, so we're looking at group three first. What is some? Um, I'm not seeing any logic created. Am I seeing this incorrectly? Oh, media three, okay. Just look through, uh, I don't see the field, but look for the branching logic and see if you see any. Yeah, let's come back up here and find. So you're look, we're looking for social media three. Let's just look at that one. Cause it looks like these are all in the same group. Okay, so you're wanting this one to show only if. I think it's what types of mentoring did you use in the past three months? And then whatever they click in the select all that apply. Yeah, so it should be, would be 49, I guess. Okay, and this is gonna be. Tanya. I'm sorry? They're yes, check, sir? They're check boxes. Why don't you do it through the, uh, um, rather than try and use the logic, why don't you uh, use the drag and drop logic builder and see what it comes up with? Okay, yes, sir. Oh, that's what I used. Drag and drop? Mm-hmm. Okay, so we're wanting 
mentoring. And this one is a monthly group, right? Right. Ah. Uh, we don't. Did you change this from a single choice to a multiple selection? No, I don't think so. Okay, because this is showing that you have a multiple selection, multiple choice, multiple selection. If I'm reading this correctly, this original um, logic was built up for a single choice, single, uh, multiple choice, single selection. Oh, maybe that did notice happen the, then. I don't know. Notice the difference in the formula. Yeah. yeah. So this is all we have to do here is um, So there, we're just so, saying, pardon? Tanya, that's going to be uh, two in the parentheses and then equals one. Right. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oops. That's why I suggest, that's what, that's why I suggest using the drag and drop. Okay. We'll do a drag and drop for each one. Yeah, it's the safest way to make sure that you don't make a, an error. That's good to know that that is safer than. Much, much. I, I, I say often that I, years ago, um, Vanderbilt, when they put out Red Cap, the default was the drag and drop. And why they changed it is totally beyond me. I think it is the worst thing that they have done, and they have done very few things that I find fault with, but this is the biggest one for sure. People should be directed to use the drag and drop logic builder first because it's built for people who aren't programmers. So that's why, you know, you should. Okay, so the logic has been corrected. Okay, thank you. Okay. And then again, it just had to do with this little bit of change. The, the field type was changed. I must have changed it then after I did all the branching. That's a common, common thing. To do, yes. That's why a second pair of eyes is always helpful. And of course, and now, none, of my, none of my buddies were added until today. <laughs> yeah. Well, you came to the right place. 